What's going on today guys? I'm back with more Telltale Batman and today we're starting on chapter 4 and I did not read the title of the chapter but I assume we'll see it uh, sometime in this video. Alright here we go. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. How I play not how you play. Actually, that would be a fun idea for a stream. We do this with crowd play on. And you guys you get to pick the path. The truth sometime. Retribution, Bruce. <laughs> Jesus. Why is nobody like even questioning the lightning bar the God. lightning bolt scars that he has? What is this place? Yeah. Breakfast. Okay, I'm up. I'm up. Well, for Christ's sake, put some clothes on. The doctor's making the rounds soon. Doctor? What doctor? Put on some clothes, Bruce. What are you doing? Looks like someone was angry. Lovely. <clears throat> Let's look at our new accommodations here. I mean, look at all the lightning scars he's got all over his body. This can't be happening. I hope it's mine. God, could you imagine, like, this can't be I, I don't understand, like, he literally had the drug scars and the veins turning blue. Like, I really don't understand why Gordon didn't see that. Like, he also didn't get prosecuted, from what I see. Better be decent. Settled? Good. Anything you need? Water, piss, rat poison? I've been asked for rope before. Not really allowed to give it out. Of course, I could make an exception for you. I want to talk to my lawyer. You're not in any position to be making demands, rich boy. I have rights. And yours were revoked after you beat Oswald Cobblepot within an inch of his life and landed yourself in here. He still has rights. You're not buying your way out. To be time. fair, he still has rights. Might as well get comfortable. This is your home now. Time to meet your neighbors. As you were. You look just like him. Your father ever tell you about me? How he sent me here? Left me to rot in this goddamn hellhole? Somebody's got to pay for that. I hope to God there is a hell. I am so sick of everyone blaming me for what my father did. I'm not him. Hurting me does nothing. Maybe not. But you're the next best thing, Wayne. God, what happened to being Batman? For real. He's just taking hits. Come on, you're not that drugged. I'm the Joker, baby. <laughs> oh, buddy, are you okay? You don't look so good. <clears throat> More like the opposite. I thank you. I appreciate the help. You're welcome. I'm the Joker. 
Coco, baby. Right? What is going on in here? It's like I told you, Doctor. These creeps were attacking the new guy. Well, who did that? Was it you? Of course not. It was mostly over by the time I got in. The new guy is tougher than he looks. Right, buddy? Bruce, is that really what happened? Go on, tell her. I don't really know what happened. <clears throat> it was all a blur. Seems like you could have experienced another psychotic episode. We'll need to keep an eye on that. So they know he's having psychotic episodes. Or took money from these men and let them into my room. He gave them a taser. I knew that you coming to Arkham could cause some excitement, but I didn't expect it to happen so fast. I'll do my best to keep you safe. I have so many problems with this. Like, you didn't get a trial. He's been having psychotic <laughs> nice episodes. And nobody's together. helping him. Am I right? Thank you. I appreciate the effort. I'm glad you're so understanding after what just happened. Good thing help wasn't far away. Hey, I'm just looking out for the new guy. I'm Dr. Joan Leland, by the way, head of psychiatry. I'll be overseeing your case personally. We'll get you transferred to a new room, Bruce. One that doesn't have your blood all over it. For now, follow me. I'm sorry, I don't think I ever got your name. Me? <laughs> He's John Doe. He's never given his name out to anybody. What? <clears throat> we just call him John Doe. Bingo. <laughs> He's not the Joker, baby. I'm John Doe, baby. <laughs> I'm hilarious, guys. I'm so, I'm so funny. John is one of our most improved patients. He's been with us for quite some time. I'm sure he'd be willing to show you around. Right, John? Oh, Why is yeah. it so blurry? So Please. I think it would be best if you stayed by his side. But there's not enough black tiles, you hear me? There's too many white tiles! You know, Doc, our last session was so enlightening. That's good to hear. Your next evaluation is in a few weeks. I'm glad you're starting to understand yourself. Oh. Every day, Doctor. Oh, he's drifting. He's drifting. He's drifting. He's gonna get grabbed. Man, that guy is cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs, bro. That's crazy. You remember the first time you let me into the rec room, Dr. Leland? How could I forget? You had to teach me how to play checkers. Yes. No, no, you need to let me go. I have to warn the president. You're trying to kill me. <laughs> they don't like it when you try to use the phone. That's because phones are for staff use only. No exceptions. <laughs> Stop that guy from trying. <laughs> Persistence. I mean, doesn't like. Stop. Oh wow, but like, doesn't Alfred know he's go. here? Don't like, why isn't Alfred us. trying to fight to get him out? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Where's Alfred? Episode four. Welcome to Arkham Asylum. <laughs> Believe it or not, some of these people are crazy. <laughs> oh God, it's the friendly. it's the big guy Mostly. from the debate, Guardian of Gotham. I watch yourself around those two. Not a big fan of strangers. <clears throat> Just a little bit. Prone to outbursts of violence. What did they do? This is Arkham, ah. bro. Use that That's sick ass. little imagination of yours. Murder, mayhem, carnage. The usual. Dude with the scars is ass. On the couch, that's St. Louis. <laughs> His favorite show 
goes on. No, <laughs> this is it. All right, friendo. Commercial break. Get up. Where is the remote? One of the orderlies must have taken it. Never fear, though. I'll go ask Leland. She likes me. Ooh, I almost forgot. Here. Well, what is this? That key's way too big, Bruce. You were like so hushed right now. He's so far gone right now. Hey, uh, I was wondering about. It's not lunch yet. <sighs> well, actually, and I it's wasn't. It's not time for meds either. Beat it. What was he wondering? All right, I'm not gonna do the main door yet. I want to talk to Mr. Billy here. <laughs> yes, I cracked it. You got a bad case of the mind knives. <clears throat> I can tell. I can tell. Just, just shove off. All right. No mind knives for me. I already got my shots. Is that boomerang, man? did a number on this guy. Just let him be. Hey there, buddy boy. You missed me? I missed you. However, the threat remains. The children of Arkham are still out there, and I will not rest until these streets are safe and firmly under my control. Or there. Anything good Are they talking about Vale? There. I must talk to Victor's ass first, please. Oh my god, where is he walking? Uh. Okay, we're taking the long way. I, I, I respect that. Bruce Wayne. You've got quite a reputation around. Taking your enemies out to stay on top. I like your style, kid. Guy I walked in here with. What can you tell me about him? John Doe? A lot of folks are scared of him. Yeah? And why is that? Same reason folks are scared of tornadoes. They're chaotic. Unpredictable. I'm not speaking as a as a profession. I find his work a bit sloppy, but he's certainly enthusiastic. I'll give him that much. I'm really talking up Victor's ads like it's nothing right now. What do you want? <clears throat> so what's the deal with that? Well, this one was a homeless guy trapped in a hopeless life. <laughs> this was a woman who just couldn't stop cheating on her husband. This guy wanted to kill himself, but didn't have the courage. All lost souls that I free from their earthly woes. Okay, yeah, that's enough. Thanks. What's that? Yeah, uh, Victor's ass is a little weird, I'm gonna be honest. Sorry, I can't talk right now. I gotta keep my eye on this guy. Not giving him the key yet. He cheats every time. He cheats. Sees what I'm thinking. Mind control. Cheater. I told you, if I could read minds, I certainly wouldn't waste my time on. Ooh, you. sick burn. What right. do you want? Time to ask Zaz what this key's about. Any idea what this opens? 
How the hell should I know? Get that thing away from me. I don't want any trouble with the orderlies. Oh, look at Zaz being a good boy. All right, time to go talk to John. Your key didn't work. <laughs> of course not. <laughs> That's not how you get out of here. <laughs> you tried it though, didn't you? <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> My enforcement squad has already seen great success. They stopped a massive attack being organized out of a local sky train depot. Politicians usually bore me to tears, but this one. Oh, wait, is he one, wearing the mask? I didn't catch it. A lot more interesting lately. He is wearing the mask. My God, Yawn. No one's above the law. <clears throat> After his vicious attack on Oswald Cobblepot, I had Mr. Wayne committed to Arkham Asylum. That's not how it works. That's not how it works. I thought you and the mayor were friends. I mean, you were supporting his campaign. I saw all sorts of photos of the two of you together. He is the reason I am in here. I can't believe he did this. Quite the temper on you. I have one too. In which Mayor Dent announced the creation of a special enforcement squad under his direct command to combat an imminent threat from the children of Arkham. Rest assured, we will find these terrorists, their stockpile of drugs, and their leader, this Lady Arkham before they can strike again. Now, this is good television. Mayor on a rampage versus freaky drug terrorist. I'm gonna find your drugs. I'm going to expose your corruption. Harvey is going way too far. You think so? I can't wait to see where he goes next. Tragically, there's still no sign of Gotham Gazette reporter Vicki Vale after her mysterious disappearance earlier this week. Mm. I wonder where she went. I think we both know she's quite the uh, lady, right, Bruce? Wait. Oh, oh, what? Tell me what you know. You want to find Vicky and her drugs, huh? Get your revenge just like you got your John Doe's smarter than he looks, man. Publicly and dramatically, something entertaining for these newscasters to talk about. I'll find a way to take her down, but I'm doing it my way, quietly. <coughs> Could be interesting. Little Bruce, lurking in the shadows. Though, I think we both know you could do more. I've been watching you for a while now, Bruce. And I can tell there's something darker in you. When you attacked Oswald, I could tell you enjoyed it. If those cops had dragged you off of him, that cobblepot punk would be dead. That wasn't me. It was just pump full of her drugs. Mm -hmm. Those just amplify what you're already feeling. It'd be the sad truth inside. sometimes. Don't be ashamed. It's in your blood. I see a lot of your father in you. She probably does too. It's obvious that's why Vicky hates you. Your dad helped bump off her parents. Why would my father have the Veils killed? I never said he killed the Veils. She was born in Arkham. Victoria Arkham. What? You didn't know that? The Arkham Character development. Ooh. Of what your dad and his partners were doing. They were gonna blow the whistle on the whole thing, so your dad, well, pop, pop. Her parents murdered, leaving her with an unquenchable. Thomas Wayne killed a lot of people. Sure the series really makes him look bad. <laughs> Pretty dark stuff. I'm not like her. I don't need vengeance. Really? Sounds to me like you've got more in common 
than you're willing to admit, Bruce. You and Vicky are both dark souls, and now you're heading on a collision course towards each other. That's gonna be fantastic! You see, I know what you really are. And that's why I really want to tell you where Vicky's moved her drugs, but you're not gonna do anything while you're stuck in here. So, I vote we get you out. How hard can it be? <laughs> Bruce Wayne. The Waynes always get what they want. All it would take is a phone call. Well, sure, but there's no phone. I can... uh, assume I can take care of that. <laughs> but it's gonna come at a price. When I get out of here, you're gonna owe me a favor. Okay? Just one. Mm, that's yeah, fine. Yeah, don't know what it is yet. Sure, one favor. Is I agree, fun. though. Excellent. Cause John yeah, Doe is cool. Fun. You'll see. I tell you what, I'm gonna make a distraction to get the guards away from that gate. The rest is up to you. you and that's where we're gonna end it for right now. Camera's up here, Daniel. Not over there. It's up here. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell. You'll be notified. You'll be notified, notified of all my post notifications. And as always, guys, I hope you enjoyed. And thank you for watching.